How's it going, guys? Welcome back to the channel today. So today we're going to continue reacting to Naruto. Holy smokes, where we are right now is crazy. Naruto and Gara about to properly throw down. We got a lot of backstory for Gara beforehand. The Yashimaru kind of betrayal as well. Oh, that hurt. That got me in the feels. But now everything... It, it, you know is at stake here as well sasuke is down for the count he's got you know he tapped into that that, that curse marked thing and now he's pretty much out sakura is basically being pinned against a tree by gara and naruto well he's frightened for his life and you can understand why as well so this is crazy and let, let's not forget as well that like you know the, the hokage has been shanked through the chest for about nine years now so how long he can hold on for against archimaru i i, I don't know but i feel like we're gonna find out what is gonna go down now guys if we can make this video hit 500 likes i will go and record the next episode reaction of naruto so if you want to see that hit that like button down below as always if you want to see the full uncut early access versions of these videos where we're about a week ahead with fully uncut visuals and audio and everything like that my patreon is live and down in the description below it also includes hunter hunter Q, naruto of course and all the opening ending reactions and everything like that the link down in the description below i also do live anime reactions over on twitch as well so if you want to be a part of those live anime reaction recording sessions the link is also down in the description below and lastly i have a discord server as well so if you guys want to come and join our ever-growing community of over 1500 crazy mofos where we're always shooting the shit talking about anime or whatever it is the link to my discord is down in the description below all right but that's it let's get straight into this so guys hit that like button hit that subscribe button let's get it <laughs> oh man Gara, man, jeez, he's so scary. Gara can't really relate to them because he never had the upbringing. Oh, Naruto and Gara are going to throw down. Oh, okay, he's made the first move. Yeah, that scares me. Your real strength scares me. Mm, he's seeing that flashback of Yashimaru again, right? Through Sakura. Oh! <laughs> that was almost like a reflex. He didn't even think about it. Oh, this is so sad, man. Why was Yashimaru doing this? So why are you trying to kill him, bro? Is it because you were scared of his power? Were you ordered to? Do we know why yet? Oh, well, there you go. Yeah, he's too scary. Yeah, I thought that was the case. I remember that now. Yeah. Shukaku. Imagine just being an experiment. Jeez. Oh, so he kind of agrees with it, I'm assuming? But then again, oh. Oh, I didn't see it that way. Resent the Kazakage? Don't resent him. Now that's messed up. I don't agree with that at all, man. Mm, yeah, he still lives by that now. This is such a horrible story, man. Oh, Gara, man. The way this show makes you feel about villains, you know? No one's really a villain or bad, it seems. Run! But he doesn't need to, I guess, because he, the sand will protect him. You just want to cuddle this kid and just tell him it's going to be okay, you know? Now, one day's head hurts all the time, man. Could you imagine? Ooh. 
Yeah. Oh, uh, boy goes rage. Yeah. You can see why, man. And what's cruel is the village then tried to use weaponize him and use him to try and attack the, the hidden leaf village. So it's like, the hell, man? You put him through all of this and then you put all your hopes into him after? That's true, he can. Don't make a tadpole. But isn't Gawabunta out with Jiraiya right now? So can he still summon him? We can't summon him, right? Is that right? Oh, no, he's not with Jiraiya. That, he's got his own one, right? Oh, my God. What is that? He looks like a gremlin. That's not it yet? Oh lord no. This is terrifying. Oh Jesus man. This is bad. Jeez. So now we've seen the moment that he realized and was betrayed by his father and you know like the, the moment that he kind of snapped and changed as a kid as so we can kind of see where he is now but seeing what he's just transformed into and this isn't even technically the you know the perfect possession yet that terrifies me um i don't know what he's got to do he's got to try and save sasuke and sakura I still re really rate what Sakura did, you know, the fact that, you know, I know she gets trolled on for being useless, but the fact that she put her life in front to protect her friend, well, you know, she, she, I, w I don't know whether she'd do that for Naruto just because she bl blatantly just adores Sasuke, but this is crazy. I don't know what's going to go on. What can Naruto do here? It's scary because I don't, he, I know that he's faced some terrifying people beforehand, but this just feels like another level. How long could you live with that sword through your chest, bro? It's not happening. He is not going down. Straight up, put respect on the name. Ah, it's coming. Ugh. But it's like they went different paths with the same start almost. They were the turning point for him. It makes you feel like had he not had these friends, would he have ended up down the path of Gara, you know? Oh man, I love this show. He's scared. He doesn't want to go back to that. It's, it is sad. Oh, man. Yes. Spoiler. Yes. He's got to then. Oh, all right. Let's see what you do. He is the devil. I'm telling you. Is he going to tap into the red chakra? Channel the nine tailed fox. Oh, 
Oh, oh, it is about to go down. There's only so much they can put this fight off. Like, it, it, it's going to happen. It's felt, this episode felt very similar to the last episode, if I'm completely honest. But we got a lot more context, a lot more of the kind of emotional background, a lot of the motivations and reasons why we are where we are, especially on the side of Gara as well. But this episode also set up Naruto to kind of see himself and almost kind of appreciate where he is in by using gara you know in front of him they both had very very similar backgrounds but one went down another path and i think that now naruto we saw that kind of appreciate and understood where he's come and why he needs to fight for this because he cannot go back to how it was before because now his life actually has meaning and at the end of the day he actually just has a life now so he has to fight for that so this is crazy i don't know where this goes now but i i, I feel like we're gonna find out any moment now like i said before guys if we can hit 500 likes on this video i'll make a reaction to the next episode if you want to see that make sure you hit that like button and if you want to see the full uncut early access versions of these videos see them way before they hit youtube with improved audio visuals and everything like that fully uncut the patreon is live and down in the description below but until next time guys take care of yourselves and i'll see you in the next one peace